My name is Bri Myers. I am a pharmacist and I've lived here in California for 12 years. I like to ride my bike and be physically active and I've been riding my bike since five and also chosen it as a way to get to work, often to save money on parking passes <laughs> and just to get around and stay active and incorporate being active into my everyday life. And I'm a mother. In the beginning, I didn't bike much and then I got involved with uh, SVBC in the 2019 as I wanted to improve biking. I had lived previously in Ontario, Canada where there's some really cool bike trails that allowed me to go to work and I didn't have to take the main thoroughfares, dri driving thoroughfares to get to work and it was just so pleasant to ride to work and listen to the birds and have the sun on my face and the wind in my hair versus like stressed out parking and um, driving around and so I, I wanted to pay that forward. I'd, I'd benefited from someone and so I wanted to improve it. And so I got involved with SVBC and we've seen a few um, bike paths go into San Mateo and I think we have um, have more of a presence with the schools and safe routes to school. Um, and now with electric bikes and scooters and the, the one wheel, one wheels, yeah, and like the full body armor, that's been really cool to see. <laughs> and just like, like to see a crew of like the one wheels going out is pretty rad. And then also to see a variety of people on their like electric scooters, like a 70 year old woman or man, not wearing a helmet, but they're like owning it, doing it, getting around, it's, that's pretty awesome. Well, being involved in SVBC, we've uh, had several bike tours. And so like with yourself, we've biked to, um, had brought my son along uh, a trip to go to the Berlin Game Farmer's Market. And that was really fun to take have like a really supportive group help uh, nurture that ride and my son's first long ride um, through the city of the San Mateo uh, to the the farmer's market and um, so that that like as a parent and just like to see like how loving the group is towards newcomers. A dream improvement would be like really building out that bike master plan and putting in some protected bike lanes I guess uh, the Delaware project um, and yeah, goal to see like some more protected bike lanes, some reduced speeds, dry, right, biking next to a car going 35 miles per hour that's giving you 18 inches is really stressful. And when you feel that wave of air hitting you, it's, it doesn't feel safe. So having some safety would be great. And just then seeing like with improved infrastructure that's safer, um, people feeling safe and getting out there more. So hopefully we'll see a lot more people out riding bikes, scooters. Um, I, I think there's a big movement to not get your kid a car, but get your kid an e-bike, which I think that's really wise. Get to know, um, do you get involved with local politics? Um, join San Mateo, uh, move San Mateo and find out who your local, uh, city council member is. Talk to them and just get out there and walk and ride and actually, and talk to your neighbors, see what they're doing and be out and about, get out of your car, because when we're in a car, we're not interacting with our environment. We're in an enclosed space where we have climate control, we maybe have the music on, but when you're walking, biking, um, scootering, you're actually interacting with your environment and really meeting people in your neighborhood. So I'd say if you're new to San Mateo, really put in the effort of getting to know your neighborhood by walking it, like taking that slow leisurely walk to notice the differences in your neighborhood and say hi to the neighbors that you always see. Maybe you don't have to um, have a conversation with them. You're just like, hey, learn their names maybe after a couple months and um, just put yourself out there. Yeah, because uh, realis <laughs> realistic expectations is anything infrastructure wise, infrastructure being like road roadways and such, it's like a three to five year process change at, at, a, at, a, at a minimum and um, we can have quick builds which is what our group move San Mateo's really pushed for is if there's a dangerous intersection maybe putting cones out and that's not something permanent so um, you can get quick builds could be put in with a couple of months um, but it is a long um, slog <laughs> and and just knowing that and balancing your advocacy with your life but also um, if if my years of doing this has taught me anything. Um, having that emotional um, attachment to uh, people is really important. If you really want someone to come out to support your cause, you need to have a conversation with them, get to know them as an individual. And um, the same with the council member, like, you know, 
don't just share your complaints, share what you think is going well. And um, remember to be friendly. <laughs> you get more uh, flies or bees with honey, flies with honey than vinegar. And um, yeah, just to be involved with your neighborhood, get to know um, if there's a neighborhood association, um, if there's a school, uh, what, what's good for our neighbors is also good for us. So knowing that um, if you're doing something to improve your neighborhood and you're meeting the local um, change makers, um, while it might, you might not see change tomorrow, it might not be next year, it's, it is, you are making a positive change and it, it just might take time. And so have some patience. Uh, thank you, everyone, to, to who's come out to rides, who's emailed your city council members, who's just gone for a walk with somebody. Thank you all city council members and former city council members, city staff, for listening to us and taking the time to listen to us. Um, those are really hard jobs, being a city staff member and being a council member or mayor. <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, thank you for all your dedication to our city. And please keep up the good work because San Mateo is so amazing. And it's a it's a great community, and there's there's room for improvement, and we can make it safer for all. <laughs>